Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel and in today's video we're going to be doing a foundation slash tint skin tint review. I am really excited to be showing you guys my first thoughts and opinions on this. I know I always say that but I am super excited. I always have like high hopes for this brand because I absolutely love this brand. Um, I tried most of her stuff and I think there's only like one thing I didn't like. It was like the eyebrow pencil. But everything else that I have tried, I absolutely love. So I'm really excited for this product because what I've seen online, like before and after, looks so good. So I'm excited to share with you guys and try it on my skin to see how it looks. And also don't forget to hit the subscribe button and like this video if you guys have not already. And if you guys want to see my thoughts and opinions, then let's get started. So we're going to be trying out today the Fenty Beauty Eavesdrop Blurring Skin Tint. Just the name on how it sounds, blurring skin tint, makes me really excited. And the packaging is like super cute. I'm really digging it. So let's read what the claims are. So I'm looking at the back of the box. And it says it's a light to medium coverage for all skin tones, blends, and blurs to instant perfection. Light as air. So that's what really caught my attention. Because if you guys seen, like, if you guys follow her Instagram, she had like before and after pictures of girls. Where they have like dark spots, hyperpigmentation, their skin looked like really, like it covered really good. So that made me like really like, whoa, I need to try this for you guys. And the shade that I got is number 10. Go on the Sephora website, it shows the other shades of what you use on the other foundation. So that way you can pick your right shade. I think I was like a never before, but we'll see how this works. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use primer, of course, because if you guys always watch my reviews like on foundations or anything, I like to put primer on just because I want to see how it works realistically because that's how I'm going to use it realistically. So we're going to do that. And then one side of my face, I'm going to use a sponge and the other side, I'm going to use a brush to see which one shows better coverage. So as always, we're going to go in with my e.l.f. Matte Putty Primer. I always go back to this one because it's just my favorite. I use it so much. There's like still a whole bunch left in there, you guys. But it's really good super affordable so it has like a little dropper for the foundation so I'm just gonna kind of drop it like on top of my face so I want it to be cute and do like squiggly lines I guess a little bit closer so the shade kind of looks okay it doesn't look bad so I'm gonna go in with my sponge on this side of my face just to see how it blends out with the sponge It doesn't smell like anything, it doesn't have a scent. So I blend it out with a sponge, you guys. Do you see nothing on this face? Oh, this face, nothing on this side. And look at this side. And it wasn't even that much. Girl. I'm already impressed. Do you see that? And just give you like a nice glow. Okay, 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 so far so good. Now let's go ahead and go in with the other side. I'm gonna use my brush. I'm gonna do the same technique as I did on this side. And as always, I'm gonna go in with my e.l.f. Um, foundation brush. This one is my favorite. I don't think they sell it anymore, but they have similar ones. I really do like how this blends. So we're going to go ahead and blend the other side of the face. So that's what it looks like with the brush. So it's a sponge. I feel like the brush gave me a little bit more of a coverage than the sponge. What do you guys think? Which side do you guys like better? I mean, they both look good on each side. I just feel like this one has more of a coverage. Girl, my skin looks really good. I am so impressed with this, you guys. Like, wow. She did a very good job. And I feel like the shade match is not bad. Um, I feel like it's okay. Once I put my bronzer on and everything, I feel like it's going to match everything but yeah you guys look at this wow the last few i don't know that i tried but this one today she's really really good 
So as always, what I'm going to do is put the rest of my makeup on and then I'll come back to show you guys how everything looks all together. Okay guys, so this is how it looks with all of my makeup on. I am so impressed. Do you guys see how it just looks on my skin? It did cover like the pigmentation I have on my skin. Like, do you guys see this? I don't think she was that much. I have to check. I'll leave everything down in the description bar how much the price was. But you guys, like, look at that. What? I think I even like this more than the foundation, the soft matte foundation. That's one I have. I think I like it more than that. Wow. What do you guys think? Do you guys think it looks, like, really good? Because I feel like it looks really good for being a skin tint. What? I'm, like, over here shocked on how good it looks. <laughs> so those are my thoughts and opinion. I really, really, really love it. Right now, it's a 10. Girl, it's a 10. And I'm going to wear it throughout the day. And then I'll keep you guys updated in the description bar to see if, like, it broke up or anything because I am a little bit oily. So, and it's kind of hot already outside. Even though I'm not going to be doing much, um, I just want to see how it holds up. I'll take a picture and then show you guys in a few hours. I'll insert it here. Hey, guys. So, at this point, I've been wearing it for six hours. The only thing that happened, it did break up on my nose because, of course, it got a little sweaty. But everything else looks really good and it stayed put. To see just how it all looked after a few hours. But right now it looks super good. I am super impressed and just loving it, you guys. But you guys let me know what you guys think. If you guys tried it. If not, you need to try it out. And try it. You guys will absolutely love it. But that concludes today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching and always supporting me. And I will see you guys on the next one. Bye.